If you want a cheap and easy way to get your favorite Rocket League items no matter what console you're on, head over to RL Exchange and use code CRUELCOKE. It's a very easy site to use with tons of payment methods available and super fast delivery. Just use the link in the description and go check it out for yourself. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing a real life Rocket League crate opening. We've got an Octane to unbox, we've got a Fennec to unbox, but before we get into that, I do want to remind you guys that every thousand subs on this channel, we give away a titanium white Octane to one of you, and all you have to do to enter those giveaways is subscribe to the channel and comment something down below. But like I said, we've got two toys to open today. I am super excited. I wasn't going to do this for a video, but then I saw them and I'm like, those look so nice. I don't know if you can see, but look at that. These things are huge. And sorry if my mic doesn't pick up my audio as well, because I'm kind of further away from my mic than I usually am for this video. Uh, I'm not a unboxing YouTuber, so I'm kind of new to this whole thing. But uh, we got my trusty pair of scissors here. Not trying to cut my mic, um, but uh, let's try and uh, bust this thing open. Come on. Oh God. Oh, I almost stabbed myself. I almost, okay. We're going to cut away from me. Away. Yep. Looks like it just slides right out. Oh, there we go. Box is gone. Unfortunately, this doesn't have a code like the Walmart toys. This is from target.com and uh, it did not come with an in-game item. I'm kind of sad. All right. I cut the octane out. It should pop out. Oh, look at that guys. It's so nice. Ooh, baby. I like that. So these are remote controlled. So there's also a remote control in here and there's also a Rocket League ball. Oh, wow, look at this. It's so detailed. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, you can't, look at that. Like it looks exactly like a Rocket League ball. It's made of plastic. Like, wow. I love that actually, just like a perfect replica. Because, like, I'll show you guys uh, the old toy that I have. It does not look like that. Okay, so I went and grabbed my other toys. This is the breakout one that I have. I'm not sure. Nope, the batteries don't work. But I actually did a video unboxing this one already. I'll set that aside. That's the one that came with a code. Then there's also these miniature uh, remote control cars. There's, like, a Dominus and uh, what is that, a Jaeger? I don't really know what car that is, but... They're very tiny, and it came with this tiny little ball here. But look at that, that's, that's not detailed at all. It's just all gray. That does not look as good. And there's also these things, these little pullback racers. They come in this little container, and you try and get one with a code in it. Not all of them have a code, but you pop it open somehow, like this. I got an octane. See, look at that. And you just pull it back, and it races forward. Kind of cool. I like to keep it in this little ball. But this was like the best version of a Rocket League ball that I had up until now. But look at the difference. That's so much better. I love that. And then we also have the Hot Wheels Octane that I have, which is like a really nice metal. It's not plastic at all. And it's like an official Hot Wheel. I have a bunch of these. I used to have a bunch of these. I've given so many away. I gave one to Yoda, gave one to my friend in Vegas one somewhere else I don't remember but yeah I only have like three left now oh wow look at this so it comes with little rims to put on the octane so you can change out to a different wheel all right I just got the controller out this is what the controller looks like that's pretty cool actually hold it like this think this goes forward that goes backwards and then this is to turn it like that you like turn it <laughs> Looks pretty neat. I like it. Looks like it also comes with stickers to put on your Octane so you can make it a different decal if you want. That's pretty sick. Okay, and then we got two different toppers and two different antennas. We got a cone topper. Nice. We got a little top hat. <laughs> that is so funny. Antenna looks like a s alien head. Oh, yep, that's an alien. And then we got a foam finger. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. If I get too close, it doesn't focus. Okay, let's just see what this looks like here. Pop this on. Oh! <laughs> okay, and then we put on the antenna here. Okay, that's styling. That is styling. All right, time to get this Fennec open. Fun fact, it has an NRG decal on it. That is interesting. I wonder how much NRG paid for that. All right, here we go, baby. Ooh, oh, paperwork flying everywhere. Okay. All right, and here we go. Look at, the oh, I like that. With the lime and the black. Ooh, 
See, I'm more of an Octane person myself, but as far as the toy goes, I think the Fennec might win. Look at that. Wow. All right, so this one has the same controller as well. We'll set that aside. And we also got the wheels. These ones have little green. Oh, are they Dracos? Oh, gotta turn it the other way. Yeah, that's a green Draco. Another fancy ball. Now I got two balls. Don't, we're just, okay. All right, and then we got more decals. Green, ooh, the lightning. Oh, I like these. These are sick. They got little rumble power-ups on the top there. Ooh, okay. Okay, this is awesome. We have two toppers and two antennas. We got the devil horns, but the moment you've all been waiting for, pixelated shades. I have the official Rocket League pixelated shades in real life now. Look at that. I might put these on the octane, honestly. Then we got the rubber ducky antenna. Oh, it's so cute. And then we got the rocket ship, looks like. Little antenna, nice. Okay, we just gotta see what this looks like on the Fennec there. Ooh, that's nice. I wanna see what these shades look like on the octane. All right, here we go, moment of truth. Oh, baby. <laughs> I like that. I like that a lot. That's beautiful. So the car itself takes four AA batteries and the remote takes two AA batteries. Those are not included, so I'm gonna put those in right now. Okay, so I guess the controller takes AAA batteries. I read the box wrong because uh, this AA ain't fitting. Dang it. Okay, so I really need these AAA batteries for the video and I couldn't find any, so here's what we're gonna do. The TV remote, TV back there. Look at that. Bang. Guess I won't be using that TV for a while. <laughs> All right, guys, here we go. Moment of truth. Oh, it's on. Okay. Now the octane. There's underglow. There's underglow, guys. <laughs> here we go, ladies and gentlemen. We're setting it down. And go. Look at that thing. Oh. Oh. Oh, my, my steering sucks. Hold on, I gotta use two hands. I'm not good at this. Oh, oh, not the light. Not my background light. Okay, we're gonna go this way, out the door. <laughs> here it comes, here it comes. Oh, into the G Fuel fridge. Oh, underneath. Oh God, oh God. The controls are a bit wanky. There we go, yes. Woo, success. Okay, we're gonna try it with the ball now. We're gonna try hitting the ball with the octane. Oh no. Come on, here we go, bang! <laughs> I suck at driving this thing, okay? This thing is tough. Oh, oh, I'm just crashing into everything. Every single thing in my room. Come on, hit the ball, hit the ball, hit the ball, hit the ball. <gasps> Let's go, we did it. <laughs> That's fun, I like that. What would I rate this toy out of 10? Hmm, I would say like a six maybe. Like the controls suck and it's not very fast, but it does look very nice. And there's a bunch of different stuff that you can like customize with it. You can add stickers onto it. You can add a topper, antenna. So I think I'm gonna use this more for decoration in my background. I had the breakout back there before. Now I'm gonna have a breakout, a Fennec and an Octane all in the background. Uh, I'm gonna go do that right now, actually. Alrighty, y'all, now we got three different cars in my background. We got the Fennec here, we got the Breakout on the bottom, and then we got the Octane on top next to my logo there. And that is forever a part of my background now. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing video, and I will see you in the next one. Peace!